Most of the Midwest started the week with sweltering temperatures, and the National Weather Service is reporting parts of the region remain under excessive heat warnings. Sue Guzman has more. From the beach to the classroom, many people in the Midwest are feeling the heat this week. According to the National Weather Service, hot temperatures combined with humidity could make it feel like up to 115 degrees in parts of the region. The late summer heat wave making it hard for some to just go outside. We just did a little bit of thrift store shopping and I said, let's go get something cold because I'm hot. Several towns throughout the Midwest are providing cooling centers for the public. While visitors at the Minnesota State Fair found relief at several misting stations. I think we're going to be okay. I mean, there's plenty of, plenty of drink stations. You can bring your water bottle with you. Meanwhile, with back-to-school season upon us, some districts are taking steps to protect students by canceling practices. One school in Milwaukee is pushing back its start date due to the excessive heat forecast. Ultimately, when we are looking at the heat um, and the predicted heat index, combined with the fact that the majority of our buildings do not have air conditioning, we want a positive start to the school year and we're looking forward to that. If you must stay outside for a while, health experts recommend paying attention to potential dehydration symptoms. If you're vomiting, you're confused, you're really tired, like excessively, um, you are having any weakness, any severe muscle cramps. They also advise to look out for those who are most susceptible to heat-related illnesses. Those dealing with high blood pressure or heart disease, checking with them, making sure that they're safe. Sue Guzman, Fox News.